Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are on episode 288 of the death walkthrough episode number two in caramel Here we are. Um, we're going into the clock tower tour today um, To rescue trapped singers that is hugely loud sound effects there Let's um just turn that down. I forgot I turned it up in the last episode. Whoops um, But yeah, this I'm recording this basically straight after the last one. So I don't actually know any of the comments on the video that has previously gone up so yeah you know it's a thing but um you know there, wizard. there are the goonies which have gone cuckoo in this clock what are you waiting for what no this is not a trap trust me you would never see a malwurf trap until it is too late just fight the scary evil gummy bears already <laughs> See? It growled at you. Go on, fight, fight. Go, go. He angry at me. Very angry. Um, but yeah, this is a fight that I am going to do off camera because it is just mobs and, you know, their life ice, you know, not too difficult. So yeah, we're just going to be back in a sec. Right. We are back. We are just killing. Um, not too bad. Just a blade and a scarecrow. Not too bad at all. Easy peasy, really. Um, yeah. All good, these guys aren't difficult. Um, See? Not a trap. Just cuckoo candy inside a clock. Now, let us continue on to see what other contentious confections await us. Gummy Acre is a badge, or should I say Gummy Acre? Um, Gummies are fantastic. I love them. We're going up to the next More level. More angry Gummy Bears? Very strange. They're not supposed to have any emotions on account of them being lifeless automatons. Like Ioni. <laughs> <laughs> I make the jest and you do not laugh. Hmm. Oh, do not be so frowny, wizard. They're just Gummy Bears. How much damage could they do to you? Well, I don't know. I, I guess I'm full health, so we could see later. But I'll be back once we've defeated these guys as well. Right, um, we didn't actually kill there. I, I just hit, um, I got earthquaked, so that was fun. One of them died, the other one has 452 health, which is not fun, but I thought I would just let you know that the myth casts earthquake, um, is not okay. Don't appreciate it, but hey, that's why we have Shipper Fools to, um, you know, succeed, I guess. Um, but yeah, the myth casts earthquake, so be careful, be very, very, very careful. Um, not cool at all. Also, the music here is fantastic. I'm just vibing, listening to the music. It is amazing. I love it so much. Really love it. Um, crit, lovely. We always crit, so, you know, it's, it's great when it ever happens. When it happens, it is great. Right, GG. There we go. Easy clap. Nice work. Next level. Give me dialogue now, please. I am remembering now that there was a new model of gummy bears they were rolling out around the time I left for the Arcanum. What was it called? Oh yeah, the Uber Bear. Built to haul up to 6,000 chocograms. <laughs> I'd hate to tussle with one of those, yeah? Anyway, one more floor to go. I'm just shaking my head at the moment because I know exactly what's on the next floor. And, um... <laughs> Who could have seen that coming? I did. Oh, help! Help! The gummies! They are no longer sweet! Now they make some mean snarls and swat at us with their paws! They've gone sour! Sour gummies? That is ridiculous! Nana only makes the sweet things! These singers are delusional with panic, wizard! Help them! Help them! Right, we're gonna do this fight on camera because Uber Bears, you know, gummy bears are cute i love them or should i say gummy bears they're fantastic i love them so much and i want to fight more of them wow we got a shad first first round that is ridiculous that is crazy um we're gonna blade we don't go first which is unfortunate um but we're gonna blade into we're not gonna blade because we got stunned that's great absolutely fantastic there absolutely fantastic um love to see us getting stunned no stun resist that's a shame it's a big shame there oh well Oof. hey at least he can't earthquake me now you know because there's nothing to earthquake because i don't have any blades on um you know what i kind of just want to hit but i also know that it's probably not the best idea we're going to discard that faint i should really take it out because we don't actually need it at the moment we don't need it um but yeah, I love this Uber Bear. He's pretty cool. He's pretty cool. He's he's cute. I love him. 
I love all of these Goomies. They are fantastic. I want all of them to be my pets forever and ever and ever and ever. Just saying. Just saying. Right, let's go for a Lulu. Sounds good. Please don't earthquake me. Watch them earthquake me right now. It'll be fantastic. Watch it happen. It's gonna happen. I bet it's gonna happen right now. Told you. Told you. 100% guaranteed that one. That I just knew that was gonna happen. As soon as I blade, they earthquake me. It's weird. It just happens. It just happens, I guess. I think Kings are were like, you know what? We're gonna make these the most frustrating things to fight ever. You know, they may look easy on the outside, but they're gonna earthquake you as soon as you put a blade up. No changing that at all. It just happens. Just happens. So, you know, he's not gonna die, and nor is Uberveer, but we can ship a full, so we should be able to kill, because they don't have much health left, if any at all. No, we, they don't have much health left. They have, what, 1,000? We can do that with unenchanted ship of fools, so hopefully we should be good. <laughs> Angry Snowpig. Who's, who cast a spell? No one. Literally no one. Literally no one. You don't see this spell anymore. It's ridiculous. But yeah, these guys, they love to cast it. All lore spells, they just seem to have them. It's quite crazy, really. Quite crazy. Um, that was not okay at all. That was really not okay. Why are you a myth casting storm healing current? Don't understand that at all. Zero out of ten. Don't like. These myth guys are not fun. I hate them. I really hate them. Earthquake and healing current? What? How? How does that work? In what universe does that work? This fight is going to take 5 million years now just because he keeps doing bad things. He didn't even die. No. No. This is so disappointing. My day is ruined. Absolutely ruined. I have to wait two whole rounds. Oh. Oh. Silly Goomies. And to think I was going to adopt you. But no. They don't want to be adopted apparently. You know what? We're just going to pass. I don't even need a blade. I'm too cool for a blade. I am too cool for a blade. So we just gonna pass. Because he ain't gonna shield. I just already know that he's not gonna shield. He does he's not like that. You see, he's not like that. He ain't like that, you know. He's just gonna cast Angry Snowpig at me all the time. Every time. Because it does so much damage and is so useful. So, you know, I'll I'll happily take it, you know. What, two hundred damage? Sure thing. Be my guest. Be my guest. Five hundred. Wow, he got a bit gooder since last time. I apologize. I apologize there. Right, finally, finally, the kill shot. That was an email. Just ignore that. Just ignore that really quickly. Well, GG. We finally did it. Finally. Only took five million years. Jeez. Oh, thank you, heroic customer. I would be sure to tell my manager of your great deeds. How strange. The gummies are meticulously designed worker drones, invented to do the grunty labor work, and maybe the occasional song and dance. They quite literally do not have a mean bone in their bodies. Yet, these formerly sweet gummy bears have clearly gone sour. But how? Eh, I am sure someone will figure it out. Let us tell the Burgermaster what we saw here. Then we must scoot to the Grand Summit. Schnell! Right. Ooh, lots of XP. Love to see it. Love to see it. Let us head to the Burger Master because burgers are cool and masters. Yes. Sour gummy bears? Who has ever heard of such a thing? Not me. We are, after all, known for our sweets, not our sours. But worry not. Nana has already gone on to investigate just how this has happened. She will ensure no valued customer goes without the welcoming pageants again. Now, I must ask, how would you rate the caramel experience so far? Five stars? Wunderbar! Go forth, gentle consumer. Explore Caramel City. Visit Nana's old-fashioned shops. Partake of Caramel's delights. When you are done looking around, wizard, meet me by the Von Trepp family gondola to go to the summit. Right, we are gonna go to the summer. Ooh, we got how many did we get? This is new. They just one. Okay, this is new. They give spellaments for um questing now, which is quite cool. Um, we now have one spellament, one whole spellament. That's basically how many I got. Um, while I was doing whole of test drum, one. 
<laughs> One whole spellament. I know. Crazy, right? Crazy. Are you ready to go to my estate? Well, yeah, my family's estate. The von hmm. Treps are the big deals in Caramel, after all. Ever since we first discovered the dark chocolate veins in the mines of Nibelheim, we have been rich and beloved by all, I presume. <sighs> yeah, I want to take you to the von Trepp estate to meet the Cabal. No, it is not a trap. Now, after you... Yep, definitely not suspicious at all. It's perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. But here we go. The first place in Caramel, other than Caramel City, which is the main hub. It looks cool. I love it. It's amazing. This is like a ski resort sort of feel. It's fantastic. Really cool. Uh, what? Uh, that means pay attention, guard, who is daydreaming instead of guarding the super important summit of cabal dignitaries. Oh, um, I was, uh, <laughs> sorry, Mr. Lord Von Trapp. It's just so peaceful and serene up here. Everyone has been patiently awaiting your arrival. <sighs> Guards these days, am I right? <laughs> I better go make sure nothing else has been as poorly managed as the guard situation. The summit begins shortly. In the meantime, maybe you go do the mingle thing with the other Kabbalists in the lodge. Exchange pleasantries. Or don't. Up to you. Right, this is my favorite bit of caramel, and it's so short, and I love it so much. So enjoy. Enjoy mass dialogue here. It's fantastic. At last, we're joined by the wizard, the divine paradox, the scion of Bartleby, the constant pain in my neck. Welcome to the end of this foolish old conflict with the Arcanum, that is. An armistice not easily won, for what schemer is wont to abandon their machinations? And yet, when I approached you, Mr. Quake Charmer, you put aside your plan to, as you so eruditely phrased it, Earthquake Cool Ranch to dust. And you, my dear copycat, you thought to clone yourself to infiltrate and divide every great house in Mirage, but refocused instead on unity. Then there's Judge Veg, who aimed to destroy this world of caramel because of its sugary appetites. But I have persuaded him toward leniency. You all saw the truth that the Cabal has lost its way. Once a coalition to rebuild the First World, we've become factious, diabolical, defeated. We should, nay, must change to survive. It's time we grow up. It's time to rejoin the Arcanum, to preserve what is, not restore what was. Wizard, will you help me usher in a new paradigm? A new alliance, a new age. Will you take the stage and my tentacular hand in peace? Let this moment mark a... What? Uh, what just happened? Ah, the great old one done got it up like barbecue. But who would do that? Reckon I'm pecking in your direction, Judge. Oh, uh, you accuse me? He fell into a giant hole. A cowardly attack. The unmistakable MO of chickens with earthquake powers. Everyone, everyone relax. It's clear this was a trap. Set by one who hates the Cabal and fights us at every turn. The wizard. Makes sense to me. Destroy the wizard. Oh, Schwitz. The cattle! They are not listening to the reason! We must make the escape that is hasty! This way, wizard! Quick, quick! Don't worry. I know you did not set the trap for the old one. I mean, you didn't, right? <laughs> of course not. But who did? And why? I suppose we will have to worry about it later. We must beat the fleet retreat before the Alta Kabbalists catch us! Yeah, that is my favorite part of Caramel. It basically sums up the whole plot of this world. We are now um, on the run from all of the Kabbalists that are here, or Kabbalists, is whatever you want to call them. I don't know. But yeah, we're on the run from all of them for the whole world, trying to figure out what these, you know, the thing that sucked them into nothingness or whatever. There's the favorite word, nothing. Um, 
is. Who knows? There is a mining camp halfway down the mountain. We can regroup there. But I am the sneaker, not the fighter. <laughs> so, I need your help to get through the temperamental candid rams that live in these peaks. Battle them while I tiptoe past, yeah? Right, we got some snack attack again. And we leveled up! Yay! 131. Fantastic. First level of caramel. Only nine more to go. Um, I'm going to be back once we've defeated some candied rams, which look absolutely fantastic. This was one of the teasers that Kings Isle gave back when they were teasing um, thing. Their storm rank 17, so not too bad, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I'll be back in just a little bit. Right, I am back. Here we go. Hopefully this kills. I don't actually know. This is completely unbladed, but I'm, I'm hoping that since they don't have too much health. Yeah, easy kill. Easy kill. They have, like, no health. They've got, like just under 3,000 so yeah that was quite a little bit extra that we did there so that's fantastic fantastic these guys are not too difficult at all um really really not too bad they cast thunder snake all the time um they cast tempest a lot of the time as well so it's not really too bad big to worry about at all right miners hello <sighs> how many more loads are there to sort my eyes they are getting bleary shh people Welcome, valued customer and wealthy patron to Nana's Old Fashioned Nougat Mine. Allow us to sing the cheery work song. As much as I enjoy the music, uh, with or without the ology, our time she's short. But we could use the passage back to Caramel City. Oh, we would help. But the gummy worms who do our mining, they went a little bonkers, yeah? And destroy the transports. But it's good, it's great. It gives us more time to sort through all the nougat ore. So, so much time. <laughs> more gummies going sour? I will not stand the chance against them. Once again, wizard, you must distract the gummy worms so I can get to Caramel City. Okie dokie, and another defeat quest. There's actually not too many of these, and they really just pile it on pretty thick at the start. Um, so yeah, don't worry. These guys are a, a mix of schools by the looks of it. Um, I didn't actually notice that when we went through here in test run probably because literally everywhere was full um but yeah i'll be back once i've defeated these gummy worms and they are so cute i love them so much righty ho i am back defeating these gummy worms they are so cute i love them i want them i would love to you know have them for food snack well well questing it would be fantastic but yes we have defeated them quite sad but there is a badge for defeating all of the things here um, there's 60 badges in Caramel, which is crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. Um, but yeah, the, the Gumi Worms, Gumi Bears, um, and more. As we go on, there's whole, nine whole pages of badges, which is kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, let's head back to Caramel City. Take me down to Caramel City, where the rides are long and everything's pretty. Sour, murderous Gumi things? Giant cavities opening up for no reason? This is not my caramel! We are sweet! We are happy! Our heels are alive with the sound of musicology, wizard! Or oh, they were, until sour gummies stopped the cheery work songs! Something is happening here. Someone is playing the long, elaborate game. Perhaps the same person who removed the old one caused the sour gummies. If so, then they have designs on the cabal and caramel alike. Quick Charmer, George Wedge, and Copycat are equally likely culprits. I will follow leads into my compatriots. You look into the gummies. Start with the Burgermaster. I smell the fear on him. He knows something. Mmm. Spooky, spooky. Um, but yeah, let's go talk to the Burgermaster. A wee little bit of a tense theme coming in with the music. It's very interesting how the music changes. Very important to know what you're meant to be feeling. You know, it just happens. Oh, hello, valued customer. How would you rate your experience at Caramel so far? Oh, well, that is an absurdly low number of stars. What was it? Our service, water quality, getting attacked by sour gummies. We replaced those. There are more on the mountains, but... but <clears throat> Nana guarantees her old-fashioned gummies are 100% pure artisanal sweetness. Well, if this is true, you must inform Nana at once. Quickly, to Nana's old-fashioned caramel corporate headquarters with you. 
Na 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 Pet Man. This is my favorite quest in the game, just because of the name of it. It's fantastic. It's ridiculously long, but it's cool. I like it a lot. Right, here we go. Well, hello there, sweetie. What can Nana do for you? Would you like to hear the history of Caramel Delights, or a VIP pet snack club, or perhaps, of course, Nana remembers you. She remembers all her valued customers. You are ever so sweet and valuable. Now, what can I do for you? Oh, my sour gummies. Well, that is what happens when you go with one of those older brands. They do not have that extra touch of sweet. Nana brand, you say? Oh, oh, my. Well, you uh, should talk to my president in charge of handling such things. Hmm, okie dokie. Excuse me, valued customer, do you have an appointment? I realize your concerns are important. They are important to us. Please hold. Thank you for holding. I will inform the presidents you are here. Please wait in the lobby for her to buzz you in and have a delightful day. Uh-huh, okay. Oh. Oh, sweetie, you could not get in. Hmm, that news of yours did sound important. So let Nana tell you a little secret. There is another door over there. Customers are not normally allowed through, but you can get in with a special Nana key. Unfortunately, dearie, Nana lost hers somewhere in the city, and our wunderbar metropolis is just so big, she cannot hope to find it. But if you have a pet, maybe it can sniff out Nana's key. If not, there is a pet store in town where you can get a pet to help you. Uh huh, I definitely have a pet though. Um, so we're gonna do this, we're gonna go find Nana's key here. Um, with our pet because I, I actually really love that they implement this um you know i didn't really like this feature it's, it's not really an interesting feature at all but i like that they're now introducing it into quests that's pretty cool i hope they continue doing this in the future i know there's a couple more of these sort of things in caramel spoilers by the way and there's also some in trident avenue but yeah there's the key Nice work. Um, what I do not like is how it takes you off your mount after you've finished. Um, yeah, that is not cool. Not cool at all. Zero out of ten. I think that should be fixed, but it's okay. It is okay. Right, let's go back to Nana, or find the president, actually. Which may or may not be a Nana. No spoilers here. But, um, I just kind of spoiled it. But, hey, it's okay. It's okay. You're finding out right now. Look at all the Nanas. Look at all the Nanas. It is... A lot of nanas. There, there's just so many nanas. Who would have thought? <clears throat> Sweetie, <clears throat> Sweetie. No, 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 no. Sweetie. <gasps> Welcome to Caramel, the Spiral's foremost purveyor of treats and. Oh, no, that's not it. Do re mi fa sol la ti do not. Na 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 na. I am Nana. Be Nana. Hamsters, cookies, candies, okay, okay. Old, sweet, creaky Nana. Hi, Miss Sweetsmeyer. <clears throat> Hi, President Sweetsmeyer. My name is Gertie. Oh, I mean, my name is Nana. You gonna buy the candy or not? Let me see if I can explain this, sweeties. You are not playing Nana the person. Forget about Nana the person. Nana is not a person. She is an ideal. You are playing what Nana represents. A company devoted to homespun country candy cooking to smiling children. We are joy in truffle form. You are company ambassadors. Hearts need to zing with delight when they see you, yeah? And see, there is a valued customer whose heart is not singing. You must keep practicing. Sorry, sweetie, how can I help you? These are just trainee nanas. Never mind them. If you have urgent business for the president, then follow me. Okie dokie. Let's follow Grand Nana. I'm sure nothing bad will ever happen. You know, what could go wrong? Caramel is the sweetest after all. Her office, I have to say, 
I really don't like that picture of her. I don't think it's particularly flattering. President Dagmar von Schwitzmeier, at your service. But you may call me Nana, the grandest Nana you will ever find. Now, what seems to be the problem, huh? Sour gummies? Uh, yes, I am afraid dear old Nana knows about them. But worry not, her sweet sciences have already found the cause. Veggies. They started popping up after we launched our happiness initiative several years ago. The goal was to spread delight to the spiral, specifically caramel delights. But it seems the witches just hate joy, so they speak the cursed words that break the unhappiness to caramel. Even now, Sweetsburg and its gummy plant is in their sway. It must be the source of the sour gummies. If only we had some champion to rout them. You are the scion of Bartleby? Wunderbar. Then you can go to Sweetsburg in the gumdrop forest, dispel the witch's curse, and stop those sour gummies. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a perfect idea for another episode. That's just my thoughts, though. Um, but yeah, this is obviously building on the lore that was placed back all the years ago when Colossus Boulevard was introduced, which I believe was in the base game of Wiz back in 2008, um, with the whole witches situation. Um, obviously we knew about them through the gobblers in Colossus Boulevard, and we'll get to them later, don't worry. But anyway, if you have any, if you have any questions or things that I should do better, or, um, other things that you'd like to say in the comments, you can say them. Feel free to do so. Leave a like if you like subscribe if you haven't already press the bell if you want to stay notified for whenever i post another death walkthrough or any other videos and as always remember to craft outside the box